Maka's guides. <laughs> hey everyone, Maka here playing Star Wars Outlaws. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to grab the two achievements or trophies that are related to Adrenaline Rush. The reason I want to explain these is because if you don't focus on them, there's something you won't get for basically the entire game. But these abilities are actually extremely useful and will help you throughout the game. So it's better to get them done early if possible. Now, the two achievements and trophies we're talking about are for killing six enemies with one use of Adrenaline Rush and killing five enemies while on a speeder using Adrenaline Rush. And your first opportunity to do this will be after you visit the planet of Tatooine. Now, the first time you visit the planet, you will be locked into a couple of specific story missions. But after you complete those, you should be able to find Moss Eisley and you should have some free reign to then head into the cantina. Here, you'll be able to talk to the bartender in order to try to progress the gunslinger quest line, which is a part of the abilities menu. Now, I'm not going to take you through the whole quest line for the gunslinger. Just find the expert intel in your journal and follow the steps. They'll take you to meet the sheriff. And at the end of the quest line, you'll have a standoff where you unlock the gunslinger abilities in your menu. The first ability allowing you to mark five total people in an adrenaline rush. Now, we will need to upgrade that to six, and there are a couple of actually different ways to do that. I think you can do it through a specific type of gear that you can equip, but the easiest way to do it is to actually go to the Gunslinger and check out how to level up their abilities. And the ability on the far right allows you to add an extra mark. If you headshot 15 enemies and kill four enemies per adrenaline rush three total times. At this point, you can either do it through natural progression of the story or go around and get a wanted level to boost it. But you should then unlock the more ability from the gunslinger, which now allows you to mark six people per adrenaline rush. If you want to get these out of the way quite quickly, you can do this at any point during the game, even after you complete it. You'll want to find an Imperial terminal somewhere in one of the open worlds. I'm still here on Tatooine. And if you approach it, you can shoot some enemies and cause your wanted level to go up. Just make sure they can use their radios to call for backup. After you have a pretty high wanted level, there should be a lot of different enemies after you. And we can start off by getting on our speeder and then wait for your adrenaline rush to fill up as enemies attack you. Try to find at least five enemies and mark them all and then pull the trigger to get at least five. Hopefully you do it a little bit more elegantly than me as it's very hard to see where you're going while the adrenaline rush is popping off. And for the six, you actually have to do it off of the speeder. It won't count. You can't get both at the same time, but the same rule applies. Attack an Imperial terminal, allow backups to come, make sure your adrenaline rush is filled and you're within range of six total enemies. Make sure they're the easier enemies and they'll get marked in red. If they get marked in yellow, it won't work because they're too strong. But if you mark six and pull the trigger within time, you'll take them all out and hopefully the achievement unlocks without a problem. It also is a challenge which unlocks more abilities for you. Thanks for watching. Hope the video is helpful. Special thanks to everyone on Patreon for supporting the show. Peace.